To be an artist, you have to have a very strong uh, temperament and drive. So I started out uh, making art when I was in the, uh, before the first grade. Four, five, somewhere in there. Um, it was a way of looking at the world. And I started doing art, even as, at a young age, I started doing artwork that was inadvertent. And I guess it would scare most people. It's just so central to the way in which, which I live. A desire to do something that I really like, that is right in, in every regard. Painting and writing my own history. My love letters to the future. Uh, reflections of the culture. Not something that society is going to avoid you or looking for you. It's, you're on your own when you're an artist. It's, a, it's an iffy world. And I didn't understand it till now that I'm older. And for me, every work that I've done is an example of a battle lost. I don't know that I, that I feel that it was that successful. I'm, I'm not very happy with it myself. But I, I, don't, I don't really give up on something until it's absolutely... In fact, I don't think I ever have actually given up. You've got to keep at it. So it took me two or three years to find the color. And it made the painting so much better. Which isn't to say I'm totally done with it, because I actually am planning on doing more. I, if I were an abstract expressionist and slopping paint around, but the way I paint is very tedious. I don't plan a painting. I come awake to a painting. I, I don't paint for money. I paint to make the painting right you know, for what it's worth. gallery because they were unhappy with it, which is something I shouldn't pay any attention to. What the hell do they know? Galleries, of course, play a very important role in an artist's life. But if it isn't right, I don't want to sell it. So I have to go on and do another one. <laughs> Certain artists feel compelled to deal with, you know, important issues. Something that was going to last and which uh, would leave an imprint. That will address the inequities that I see in the world. Hey, it's not a bad civilization when you've got a lot of that going. It, it all uh, leads to an end. Depends upon the artist's temperament. It, it's hard for people to interpret uh, an intended meaning. Um, but I think once you understand it, it's, a, it's liberating. Well, you know, they say, ars longa vita breve est. Art is long, life is short. It's art that is long. Immortality is the artist's only, is the only chance. Yeah.